three, two, one. Oh, I've got two big bags of heavy stuff. Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, hi, my name is Liz. Thank you so much for clicking on this video today. I've gone for a different hairstyle today. Sort of similar, my slick back ponytail, but with front bits. I've seen a lot of people doing this recently and yeah. So today I have a huge PLT, pretty little thing, clothing haul and I am super excited about this. I haven't done a haul, a clothing haul in so long. It's well overdue and I'm super excited to be back in my beauty room and yeah, I feel like the lighting is so much better in here. I'm still thinking of filming in my room sometimes because I got a cute little background set up but what do you think? Let me know. Before we begin, please make sure to subscribe to my channel. We are super close to a thousand subscribers and I'm so thankful and grateful for that. So thank you so much. And make sure to thumbs up this video if you enjoy it. Let me know your favourite piece down below in the comments and what you're going to buy. Also, all the links will be in the description box down below for you to go check them out as well. So definitely check that out. So without further ado, keep on watching if you want to see what I have bought. Okay, so I have got two huge bags. Okay, so I will let you know the name of everything, sizes and everything like that, just for reference. The first thing I got is actually not a clothing item. I bought a pillow for my room, which I am redecorating my room at the moment. It's in progress. The video will be out soon of like a new room transformation sort of decorating video. So keep an eye out for that. Again, make sure you subscribe. I bought this pillow. They sent me the wrong one. Um, I don't know whether it was out of stock after I bought it or before I bought it but it wasn't online. I don't know, because I've gone back on the website to double check which one I actually bought, and it's definitely a different one. But it's not on the website anymore, so I'm not sure. But also, this one isn't on there either. But I noticed it's on a photo of a different one, but it's not for sale. Do you know what I mean? I will put up a photo of the one that I actually bought by here. Maybe I'll pop up a picture of the online shop what it looks like anyway. Yeah, I'll do that for all the products. I actually quite like it. So I am going to keep it. I believe it was £18, but, well, the one I bought was £18, but I got a 20%, I think it was, off. It looks like a summer's day outside, but I bet it's so cold. <laughs> anyway, so it looks like this. I believe it was a 45 by 45 centimetres. And yeah, it's super cute. I'm going for that, like, boho rustic sort of vibe sort of I'll have to watch the video to find out um, but I thought this would look super cute on my bed this is called the Sakandi Gandhi Scandi boho cushion and that's what it says it's not I don't think it's PLT so it's Sass, Sass and Bell so I'm guessing it's a different company um, I think they sell this in like other places. I know they sell it on Amazon, so go, I'll link that down below just in case they don't have it on P PLT anymore. But yeah, super cute. You can take it off, which is good, um, if you wanted to switch them out sometimes. But I'm well happy with that. I'm going to put it on my bed when I'm done. Okay, so I'm going to jump straight into the coat that I bought. Now, I'm actually obsessed. I've actually seen this coat around on the internet a lot lately. A lot of people have bought it. I've seen it mostly on Instagram. My friend here on YouTube bought it as well and it looks so good on here so I just had to. It's this cream Borg sort of coat. You're gonna see it so much better on the try on clip. Oh, I got fluff everywhere. This is called the Cream Maxi Borg Coat. In a, I did get a size 10 UK size, but hopefully this looks really, really nice. Again, it's a maxi length, so again, you're going to see it so much better on the try on clip. 
It's got pockets, really deep pockets. It's got a tortoise shell button, I think it's called. It's got a few going down. And yeah, it's like a v-neck. It's got another pocket by here. The material is absolutely beautiful. Well, happy with this. I think it's going to keep me really warm, even though we're coming... Well, we're not really coming to the end of winter yet because it's not until like the end of March, I think, or April, um, spring comes. But I think this would be a nice like transition coat because I've never had one in this colour as well, which I'm quite scared, especially because I've been self-tanning lately. That was good. And it was also on sale, just to let you know. I think it was like £60 down to like 28 or something. So your girl was definitely buying it. So then I did get a lot of like loungewear jumpers and stuff like that in this haul because I thought I was in need of some um, really oversized slouchy vibe in this video it's going to be. So then next I got the Black World Tour Slogan Sweater in a size large UK. And oh my god I'm obsessed with this. It's got 1987 New York 1987 wild and free on it. I've seen again this going around quite a bit. This matches my theme in my room. <laughs> the colours. Again a little hint. Um, it's got that on the back and it's super oversized which I love. It's also got a really soft material in the inside. I am super happy with that. Again try and clip will look even better. Um, it's got nice cuffs at the sleeves and it just flows at the bottom. I am super happy with this. On to the second bag. So big. Okay, so I'm literally just pulling anything out um, that I can. Ooh, I remember getting this. I've kind of forgotten my order, to be honest. Keeping on a trend with the knitted sweater vest, I had to get a chocolate colour. You will see a recurring theme in this haul. But chocolate is gorgeous at the moment i'm loving it and this is the chocolate v-neck knitted side slit vest and i got a size large because i wanted to be oversized i could have went with an extra large to be honest but super cute the material's lovely and i really like the stitching in this and obviously it's got no sleeves love that i would definitely wear that over a white shirt isn't it exciting when you forget what you've ordered so i did buy a pair of jeans which is very tricky for me at the moment because i have put on a little bit of weight and i hate wearing jeans at the moment but these look so cute and i've been meaning to get some uh, ripped hem jeans so these are the black split hem jeans in a size 10 I don't know whether I should have got a 12 because my butt has grown but they don't feel stretchy at all which I'm very scared about black always makes my camera go a bit wild so they do look very long as well but the slit in the jean looks amazing love that and yeah, like I said, they don't feel stretchy at all. But yeah, it really cinches at the waist. I can see the shape of them. It goes like in at the waist, which is great because I have such a smaller waist compared to the bottom half. It's got pockets at the front. It's got a silver buckle, which I like because I like silver. I will come back if they don't fit on the try-on clip and let you know. I'm gonna kneel down a second. I look like an absolute mess. I've just washed my hair. It's all natural. <laughs> I don't normally speak in my try on clips, but these jeans, no. They do not go up. I know I've put on a bit of weight, but okay. I am gonna make it my mission to fit into these. There isn't even that much to go, like, I could probably, no, that's all that's going. No stretching them at all whatsoever. And they are super long as well. So I could only wear these with like high platform shoe, like trainers or heels. I'm hoping you can see, but I love the split hem, but they just don't stretch. Oh my God, I know I've put on weight and all, but 
come on now PLT. I don't know whether I'm going to keep them and try and <laughs> lose some weight but yeah thought as a side note I'll let you know. <laughs> I'd be curious to see if they fit the length as well because I am only 5'3 um, and they look quite long but we'll see. Okay so I did just get a plain black hoodie again. I got one a while ago and it's got paint on it and makeup on it and stuff like that so I thought I needed a new one and it was in a size small so it was more of like the fitted type but I'm more into the loungy oversized look these days. This is the ultimate oversized hoodie in a size large and obviously black. Um, these hoodies are super comfy. Obviously it's just a plain black hoodie and it's got a big pocket, sorry about the colour, it's got a big pocket at the front which is great and again it cuffs at the sleeves and it's got drawstrings as well which is good and it's really nice material in the inside again super soft super cozy and I can't wait to lounge around in this um, definitely vibing with the more oversized look it's definitely a really big size probably could have went bigger to be honest but yeah that is the oh I just got makeup on it good job it's black that's the black hoodie exactly the same but I got it in chocolate brown and wow okay what size did I get this in so this is the chocolate ultimate oversized hoodie yeah so the same one and in a size large but guys this is huge compared to the black one so their sizes do differ but I absolutely love the I probably prefer this size to be honest it is super big it's so big Um, the pockets are huge well the pocket is huge it's just one it's that big I can't reach the other side there we go it's just one long big one and drawstrings again exactly the same but in a chocolatey brown funny sizing you're gonna tell on the try on clip that this one is so much bigger than the other one but yeah just bear that in mind i'm gonna throw in the chocolate again I'll show you the joggers that i got now on the website these look like a more of like a milky chocolate lighter brown color yeah these are just called the casual jogger in chocolate and i got the size 10. i was going to get a backup pair of the black ones but then i saw these and i thought i may as well go with these because i'm loving the chocolate vibe but as you can see on the model they look well molly may they look really like light um and also on the video of molly uh she she looks like she's wearing different ones but I'm actually preferring these ones I actually prefer the darker chocolate colour which I'm very happy about to be honest um can't go wrong with these casual joggers to be honest they've got a drawstring which is hidden which I quite like oh oh no it doesn't it doesn't have a drawstring on these ones okay all my other ones that I've bought from the casual jogger range in different colours they've had a drawstring but these don't but that's fine whatever hopefully they fit I did go with a size 10 because I thought if I lose a bit of weight then I can just use the drawstring to pull it in but let's hope these fit they've got really nice big pockets on the sides um, both sides but yeah just your really oversized casual jogger again with the chocolate what is up with me and chocolate? Oh yeah, oh my god, yes, I remember this. Okay, so this is the chocolate ribbed under bust drawstring long sleeve crop top. God, that's a mouthful. Uh, in a size 10. Size 10 is like my safe, safe zone at the moment. But this is absolutely beautiful. I'm so glad I picked this up. Obviously you're going to see it a lot better on the try and clip, which I keep saying. It's got a drawstring on the side there, which you can tie up. And this detailing at the front is so, so gorgeous. I'm thinking night out when we can, you know. It's got long sleeves. I really like the ribbed material. It does look a little bit see-through, but it might just be because of these lights. But if you've got a bra on and you know stuff like that it'll be fine 
Oh, I'm super excited about that. Obviously, with the drawstrings, you could probably make it as cropped as you want it, which is good. Oh, love that one. Okay, so we have another jumper. Now, I was going to get this in a, like, sand creamy sort of colour, but they didn't have that in stock anymore. But I'm kind of glad I didn't because I've already got one of the casual hoodies from PLT in that colour. So I'm kind of like, may as well get a colour that I don't have in a hoodie, which is white. And this is the Cream Lake Shellen? Shellen printed hoodie in a size large. Sorry if I said that wrong. It's definitely large. It's definitely the size of the chocolate one. I think the black one, black hoodie that I got is a small large, which is weird, but I'm so obsessed with this print on here. I, think, I thought it was just different and it was in the new in section, which can never go wrong with that. And I need to be careful that I don't put it on my face. It's got a big pocket at the front again and it's got a big hood. Is it soft in the inside? It's soft in the inside. Yes, that is amazing. I just can't wait to wear all these big oversized hoodies. Yeah, that is the print. I'll obviously show you a bit better on the try-on clip. I'm hoping it's not going to be see-through because I don't really tend to wear bras very often with hoodies, you know. Okay, so I only have one item left, which that has flown by. I've only been filming for 25, well, 26 minutes, but obviously I'll try and cut it down. But which is, it's kind of a good thing because my videos are always so long and I feel like sometimes people can get bored. I don't know, do you prefer longer videos or shorter videos? I thought I'd get something in khaki. You know, I'm wearing khaki at the moment, but I got another hoodie. <laughs> Obsessed with my hoodies. And this is like a khaki green with like black accents on it. Uh, so this is the PLT Sage Khaki Oversize Slogan Print Pocket Front Hoodie. And I got this in a size 12 because they were only doing like sizes. I really like the black contrast. You can also get matching joggers, which I didn't get because my basket was getting quite full. It says hoodie, pretty little thing on the front, and it's got a big pocket at the bottom there again. And I like the bottom actually, it's like quite um, cinched, is that the word? Quite cinched. And then on the sleeves it's got hoodie dash dash, pretty little thing. Seasonal, this came as a tracksuit on the sleeve, so obviously you can get the matching joggers. Um, maybe I'll get those next time and then I think it's just plain yeah it's just plain on the other sleeve and on the back it's just plain again plain Jane on the back I'm so obsessed with this and I can't wait to put it on and just chillax in my house with it and again it's super fluffy inside love that that is everything from my haul. I really hope you enjoyed it. Let me know down below, like I said in the intro, which one you like the most. Which item was your favourite? I'd love to know. Let me know if you're going to pick up any pieces. Again, like I said, the links will be in the description box down below. So go check those out. Before you leave, please make sure to subscribe to my channel if you aren't already. If you are, then thank you so much. Or if you've just clicked on that subscribe button, thank you so much. We are so close to a thousand. And I keep saying that, but it means the world to me. And I hope you all know that. So yeah, make sure you are subscribed so you don't miss out on any of my future videos because there's a lot coming this year. I really hope you enjoyed. Make sure to thumbs up this video if you did. Go head over to my Instagram where you'll see like makeup looks like this and more creative looks as well. And also go head over to my TikTok. I've been doing that quite a lot recently and it's been getting me through lockdown. It's been a lot of fun. <laughs> Um, I've been really enjoying it. So yeah, go check that out. It's just all Makeup by Liz Rose. I really hope you enjoyed. I hope you have a lovely rest of your day or evening, wherever you are, and I'll see you in my next one. Bye guys.